Shivers and Tucker in the backfield, as is Hicks in motion. Tucker tripped up. He came up short. Tracy Robertson dug in and got to Tucker. That is all up to the official in the spot because that was a good defensive play. Did they give him the generous mark? Well, Looks short of our line, but they will measure. Joe Williams and Tracy Robertson came in and blew it up. Well, it started right at the point of attack. There was great pressure. Robertson, also Jean-Baptiste, made great pressure inside, which helped collapse the pocket. And a great job by Robertson getting so deep into the backfield. Just by that. Remember, our yellow line is not an official marker. It was well short on the spot of where our first and ten line was. But the chain gang comes on, and Coach Patterson's offense stays on the field. that spot of the ball is being reviewed. I think that's a good timeout call, not just for that, but because it's a good point to regroup defensively for Baylor because you put so much into that. You, you put, tell me, Rod, where's the knee, where's the ball? Well, he's down before our marker, but you made the point about what the marker means. I mean, that was a really good defensive play, but it was all dependent on the spot by the official. And it looks like well, he spotted just a little bit further than where we saw that. He spotted the ball inside the 31, but it looks like it should be beyond the 31. Here's the overhead. Well, that looks more like it's around the... Two or just inside well, the, the 32 yeah, on the other side of the yeah. 31 the point is the ball currently is marked inside the 31 yeah. that's the difference yeah. well even if they don't get this I like the challenge regroup defensively your guys put their heart and soul into this and you want them to move on now you gather them up you tell them right. what they need to do to move on but you don't want them thinking about giving up the first down after a great play when they've got to come back and play another play to keep TCU out of the end zone. So I like the call to challenge this right here. Meanwhile, if the spot on the field stands for Coach Patterson, his offense on the move, trying to tighten things up here, trailing by 11. But no need to change anything. You've got two timeouts. You've had good game management by your quarterback right now. So if the call stands, I think if you're TCU, you keep doing what you've been doing. You take the little short throws. You run a little bit inside. Agreed. You've got plenty of time. You know, and that really was the game plan coming in for Paul Hall. Hey, we've got a good defense. We're loaded at running back. We've got great receivers. Manage things. Go yeah. out and have a nice, easy night to get your starting assignment career off the ground here. But uh -oh. he got thrown into something, yeah. didn't he? He track got meet. thrown into an old track meet. <laughs> 34 points on the board for Baylor and TCU is looking to close that gap. Welcome back to college football, Tess. <laughs> I'll tell you, Rod. You know, on a weekend where you look at those two big-time games on Saturday night, of course, Oregon and LSU and Boise and Georgia, but the rest of the schedule, there are people pointing at this game as the next best game. It's lived up to the hype. I tell you, it's a nice lead-in to what you're going to see on Saturday. Hey, here's the chain. On the other side of the field. That's the point inside the 31. Where you have to get inside the 31. That's that chain they brought about. After further video review, it is determined that the runner was down at the 32-yard line, meaning it's short. Therefore, it will be Baylor's ball, first and ten. I think they got that right, Rob. Yeah. So they reverse it. The fans in purple, incredulous. The rest of Floyd Casey erupting in celebration. 
If you are a turnover on downs. If you're a TCU fan, you go, how often do you see that? How often see do you over. see a challenge on a first down call and then get it overturned? Overturned, turnover on downs with under two minutes to play in this first half. A thrilling first half.